Hi guys! Today's video is going to be a Dollar Tree and Five Below makeup haul. So the items I'm going to show you were all bought a while back because I was getting low on some of my makeup and I thought I would try some new products. So all of this was bought way before all of the stores started closing. So the first item I picked up was this set of rose gold eyeshadow brushes from Five Below and I absolutely love the pink glitter inside of them. That was definitely the selling point for me but they also are really good quality. I'm actually really pleased with them. Next at Five Below I found these five different colors of Perfect Matte Lip Gloss and these are more of a natural tone which I really like because I don't like super colorful um, lipstick but I've been mixing some of the colors like I'll put one that's light on the inside of my lips and then the darker one on the outside. It gives a little bit of contouring I guess. So this next item is more of an experimental thing that I have been wanting to try for forever and they are fake lashes. Um, these I got for photo shoots though because a lot of times when you're doing photos or filming, a lot of times your eye, your eyelashes don't show up as well as they do in real life. So I just got them to experiment. I still have not got the hang of how to put them on yet. So I don't know if I'm actually gonna end up using these but I thought it'd be fun to experiment with anyway. So that was it for the five below items and next I went to Dollar Tree and I picked up some makeup of some of the brands that I've tried before and I like. So I got these two different colored palettes of eyeshadow from LA Colors. I actually really like this eyeshadow and I've worn LA Colors before and I find that it seems to stay on pretty well. Um, these ones have some shimmer in them which is kind of fun. Next I picked up these eyeliner pencils which I actually use to fill in my eyebrows. I find that having a fine tip pencil just works better for me than like a brush on thing. So this is the color that I get. Next I got these other eyeliner pencils which one of them is a turquoise color with some shimmer in it and I use that as eyeliner sometimes and then the other one is just like a dark brown and that I use for eyeliner as well and um, the one on the left I'm finding is not staying on too well. It's kind of like it rubs off really easily so I am not super happy with that purchase but I wear it around the house and that way I'm not using up my nice stuff so I am still using it but I wouldn't necessarily buy it again or recommend it to anybody. Okay, so next I got this LA Colors Chunky Red Colored Lipstick and I actually bought this for my Maleficent photo project that I've been working on and I wear red lipstick for that. I am not a red lipstick type of person out and about. Um, like I said, I like to wear the natural stuff, but for a dollar for my costumes, I thought that was a good deal to get that. Okay, so this isn't makeup, but it's kind of related. I also found this natural color of nail polish and I really like it. It says it lasts up to 10 days, which I was kind of skeptical, but I was shocked it actually did. I think it lasted closer to two weeks and I was showering and doing dishes and all the normal stuff that I do and it was not chipping off. Now, when it does start to chip off, it doesn't show that much because it is a natural color. So I am super impressed with this and I'm really glad I got it. The last thing I found at Dollar Tree was this e.l.f. under eye concealer and highlighter. It's like a two-in-one and I've actually been pretty happy with this one. I've been using the concealer under my eyes and it works pretty, pretty well and the highlighter I just do on different spots like on my cheeks and my nose and stuff and I can't say it's super visible but I mean I guess it gives a little bit of pop of highlight so um, I would probably buy this again I think in future. So the last two items I got were from Kohl's and the first one is this glow blush and bronzer palette and I like all of the different shades that you have to pick from in here and it's been working pretty well. It matches my skin tone fairly well. Since it was free it's something that I'm able to use around the house as well and not have to use my nicer stuff that I save for when I go out. 
And then lastly, I got this Smoky Eye eyeshadow palette, which um, I don't do smoky eyes very often and I go really really light when I do because I don't like them to be super dark But again something else that I'm able to experiment with for like photo shoots and stuff And there were some colors in here that I don't currently have so it's really fun just to try new things especially when it doesn't end up costing any money in um, once you have coupons and all of that so um, Yeah, that is everything that I found and I love not spending a lot of money on makeup because the worst thing is when you spend a lot of money and then it ends up not working well or you don't like the colors and then you have this big palette you're stuck with. That's why I tend to buy cheap stuff but it doesn't necessarily mean that it's always the best quality stuff but it works okay. I feel like I kind of rambled in this video but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and I might have another haul that's coming up soon. It's a frozen haul of some frozen things I've found recently again at dollar stores and stuff. So um, thanks for watching. I'm gonna go ahead and end this and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!